and Lance behind the camera. Say hi, Lance. Hi. Um, just wanted to give you a little rundown uh, visual on the uh, shot lock. Um, as you can see here, it's got uh, it's got my semi-auto. This is a Benelli Super Black Eagle II um, with the breech closed. This here is what I was talking about. I was referring to as a tang, uh, basically, which you know opens and closes. You can obviously lock this open and a future model of this may have a cutout in here which might allow for this to be locked open as well but for right now we're going to stay with this because it works with uh, it works for um, pumps it works for semi-autos and it works for over and unders but I'll walk you through the product here just a little bit to uh, show you how easy it is uh, to operate um, first I'll open it you turn you turn into you, which is a little different than what maybe a normal right-hander would want to do. Um, but you turn in to open it, and as you can see, it's very, very easy to open and very simple inside. One hinge here, and then two locking points that, as this closes, goes into the inserts here, and you lock it, basically securing it, securing it on there. I mean, it's you know, it would take you. Uh, I don't know, crowbar, whatever, to try to start bending this heavy gauge metal. I believe it's uh, 16 gauge metal, um, and, and that's tough to do. So um, anyways, very, very simple, very easy to get your, your guns in and out of. And you'll notice I've got my sling on this one, but very easy to set your guns in and out, or to take it in and out. Um, the inside of the unit itself... Um, basically again you've just got the one hinge you've got felt on this back side that will will help protect your the the finer some of the metals on on any of your guns I'm not as concerned about my camel wrap guns as I am obviously my my good over and unders or maybe a nicer pump but uh, one hinge here felt backing on this metal and then there is a piece of foam which it will come in just a square piece that you know somebody can just cut and place in there and then as you can see and maybe I'll have Lance kind of zoom in on it and how close we are but um, basically a, a variety of different mounting hole options um, these bigger ones are all countersunk so that they will be you know flush flat but uh, this has just got two uh, of our smaller wood screws it will come with a much larger wood screw two of them actually possibly four uh, that will allow you to get this into a 2x4, 2x6, whatever your wall stud is. And then there are two pieces here which basically can be reconfigured. Uh, you can set it so that it's up higher, you can set it so it's down lower. I won't take this off the wall to show you, but those are just mounted on here with screws. This two, uh, these edges here, and all in through here, are all felt lined as well. So um, that's pretty much the, pretty much the basics of it. Um, like I said, very, very easy, very simple to operate. Um, you know, more of a security-minded product at this point, which will have uh, applications for sportsmen. Uh, you can imagine this mounted anywhere, back of your pickup, behind the seat, uh, you know, screwed into the cab, um, maybe on the bed, back of your tailgate, um, you know, and then obviously the inside uh, uh, applications too around the home behind closet doors um, in a number of different uh, locations so right now just one color uh, black is planned but we will uh, you know, obviously consider other options you know maybe we go out and take a picture and dip it in its camo um, whatever it might be um, the inline push button is is a mechanical lock and it's like I say it's very 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 simple to operate uh, you can change the combinations on it uh, to set it for your own personal um, like liking. Uh, the knob is is yes, it's large, but um, I think it uh, I think it needs to be, and it's kind of nice that it is because uh, if you're operating this in in low light conditions um, and uh, you need to uh, get to your your knobs and make a quick quick move to open it and get the unit or to get the gun out, um, you can do so.